Hartlepool struggled to score at home these days but had not conceded at the Victoria before kick-off. And once James Poole had given them a first-half lead, manager Neil Cooper could have been forgiven for backing his side to keep it against Carlisle, who struggled away from home. After the break came a moment which will haunt Jake Jervis. Latching on to Paul Murray's sloppy pass, he found the composer to round Scott Flinders and lost it all to shoot horribly wide. Carlisle pushed for the equaliser and thought they had it when Mike Edwards turned to smash home the loose ball. However, his shove on Flinders had not gone unnoticed. Back came Hartlepool looking to seal the game. Carlisle failed to deal with a free kick and, unaware of the presence of Steve Howard, they saw his effort, luckily for them, crash against the bar. But the visitors continued to pressurise and after Flinders could only parry this free kick, Danny Karamatri fired home the rebound 50 minutes in time to open his account for the campaign. Neil Austin then received a second caution after tripping Matty Robson to reduce Pauls to 10 men and with defender Peter Hartley taken off injured, it was part of what Cooper described as a mad few minutes. Carlisle took full advantage, Robson who was given his Football League debut at Hartlepool by Cooper scored the winner from Frankie Simic's cross to give the Cumbrians their first away win of the season.